we've been working at this for at least 20 years to teach our children about the culture, the language, the stories. The language brings out a lot about our culture and about the history of our village and who we are. So before we actually received this funding, our language was in peril, it was dying off. And there was a real reluctance to try to use language. I felt it within myself. There was a lot of shame because we didn't understand the language or know the language. We've done it before where we had like three or four jobs and we're trying to learn language at the same time and we're trying to work with our elders and we're trying to um, work with our linguists uh, at the universities and it just doesn't work. So it's had a tremendous positive impact in the opportunity and the level of Atna that's being learned. People took interest and they're excited about it. They're excited about it. They're they're wanting to do more. Anywhere that we got in now, we've gotten a good response back and people wanting to know more. I'm a lot more comfortable with learning and practicing and sharing and now I feel like it's blooming within our community. And I'm seeing it used in everyday life. So we're constantly moving up and moving forward. And, and that's where the kids are. They're always been right with us. They learn faster. They're just right at our heels. We have preschoolers in the school all the way up to our elders. You know, it's really in three short years had a big impact on this community. I think that the community is more open to learning, whereas they were more afraid of speaking the language. It's just like a breath of fresh air, like we can do what we've been doing on our own, but now we can do it with some help. The kids are right behind us, and so we need to also focus on our teachers so our teachers can progress in the language. This funding has opened up the opportunity for our very skilled and wise teachers to come with us. I think there's so many healing things that are coming out of this. For myself, it was a void. For my daughter, her cultural identity, that's really important to me as a parent because I can't teach that to her, but I want to support that so she knows where she comes from. Having elders at our classes, even learning sometimes for the first time has actually brought a lot of healing. It's been a pretty big impact. When you can absorb those words in and then live them every single day, you begin to heal as a person and then your community begins to heal. It's very empowering to hear the language used, it, people retaining it and then sharing it because it, it's really revitalizing it. I would like to say Chinan on behalf of my tribe and our Yanida'a school to all the folks at ANA that have supported us in this project and especially on the Esther Martinez Initiative team. Thank you very much, Chinan.